What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm really excited because Abel just launched brand new freaking colors to their core collection. So in celebration of the new launch, I thought I would go into a detailed review on the collection as a whole. All right. If you are new to this channel, hello and welcome. My name is Ashley and I make new videos every single week on all things fitness. So definitely hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss anything, girl. But before we get into this try on and review, I do want to make note that I am a sponsored able athlete and super proud. I absolutely love them. But also note that this does not change my opinion. This is an honest, in-depth review. These are my thoughts and opinions, the pros, the cons, keeping it super real as usual. Let's do this. So in this core collection, we have a little bit of a mixture. We have shorts, leggings, and sports bra. We're talking about each and every one today. So let's start with their new colors. We got a couple colors here. We have their steel blue and navy blue, leggings and sports bras. I am a size small. It is very true to size. I will have my measurements down below for reference. So we're gonna start with the sports bra, okay? This is the only sports bra in their collection, okay? They don't have a variety of sports bras. It's the one sports bra. So what we're looking at is a solid opaque color, all right? This is the steel blue. This kind of has the like smoky gray look with an undertone of like blue, all right? So it's a grayish blue color. Very different cool tone. So it has a really like kind of thicker padding than you would find in most bras. So there is a nice support, um, a very, very thick band. I wanna say it's almost two inches, okay? I do like that. I prefer having a larger band. It just makes my girls feel a little more secure, you know? It is in fact a racer bag, but with strap, okay? So you got the chunky and you got the sexy strap going on. As you can see, the inside is lined with like a mesh. It is very breathable. This whole set is breathable. It's 87% nylon and 13% elastane, so it is wicking and it's stretchy. All right, keep that in mind. The navy blue color that they have, very, very, very gorgeous, rich color. It, to me personally, looks a little more gray than navy blue. You still have the undertones, the, the blue, like the dark blue, navy blue, but you have a little bit of that gray in here, just so you know. So if you're expecting a real, just straight up navy blue, keep that in mind that you have like more of a grayish navy blue. So guys, like I said before, they only have the one bra in this collection. So. These two are identical, all right? Same cut, same style, same everything. Every other color bra you see in this video, same identical bra. I do wanna note something that I found a little bit interesting is that the steel blue mesh lining in here, the breathable liner, is white. And the navy blue is black. I also have some other really cute colors. I have mauve wine. This is a beautiful burgundy color. Love it with the black liner inside. We have jet black as well, love it, because it'll go with absolutely anything. I can mix and match with all their core leggings. I've been doing that a lot lately, so you, you really can't go wrong with just like the solid black. And the last core bra I have is in placid blue, which is like a baby sky blue. It is beautiful. This is one of my favorite colors, I would say. So they really definitely like their blues, you can see. All right, I think they got like mostly shades of blues and grays. Very, very beautiful. And look, you guys. You got a blue mesh. <laughs> so overall, it's very beautiful. You have the Able logo on the back here. You got the little keyhole peek up boo right about her. For me, the support is great. I would definitely say this is very high support given the, the really thick bands, the padding, the actual straps. So it's high support. Um, the only downfall for me in particular is if I'm doing like abs where I'm laying down, and this could be because my side boobs literally take over everything. <laughs> I have no cleavage, but I have a lot of side boob. So I feel like ever so slightly, I could kind of like see a tiny bit of side boob over here. So keep that in mind if you have like bigger side boobs. <laughs> but other than that, I do have to say it kind of does work miracles. You'll see in the overlapping footage, my small hoo-hahs look amazing. <laughs> so it is really flattering in that sense, okay? It makes a girl with no chest really look like I have a chest. And I think it's because of the padding. I think it's like the nice support here, just kind of like bringing it up a notch, you know? 
And this baby is $30, so very reasonably priced. Like I said, you, you pay for what you get, the quality is high, you get that. This bra is not adjustable. There's no adjustable straps on it. However, for me personally, do not need it, okay? It fits like a gem. It is extremely true to size, okay? It doesn't restrict me. It doesn't feel like tight or anything or make my back bulge because <laughs> I hate that. It is, it's, it's spot on, it is spot on. Other than my side boob issue a little bit when I'm doing ab work, it's a great bra. The inserts do come out as well. And to be honest with you guys, I think I could go even without the insert because the, the material itself is like thick enough and opaque enough that I think, I think you might be able to get away with that. So don't hold me to it, but I'm just saying, if you didn't like bra inserts, you could take them out. Okay guys, so we have some core shorts we're gonna talk about for a hot minute. I have the shorts in mauve wine again, placid blue, and the jet black. Okay, so I have three different colors. These shorts, let me talk about these freaking shorts. So this whole collection here is not seamless. Just want to make note of that, okay? Nothing here is seamless. Usually, I prefer non-seamless pretty much everything. <laughs> but in this case, um, with the way they constructed these pieces, it doesn't affect me in the negative way that I usually feel when wearing seamed leggings and shorts. So, for example, this is why I am definitely okay with the seams. They provided a really large band on here, okay? I like that because you you can pull them up a little bit and make it still look like you have a nice booty. There's a lot of room here. I don't like when the band is super tiny, falls low, and then it kind of gives the illusion that your, your backside is like... <laughs> so, I love this. It's the same with the leggings. Like, they provided a large band to kind of help tuck you in a little bit. It does have that tummy control. It's compressive, for sure. I would probably say this is like mediocre compression. It's not high, but it's definitely not low, okay? You can feel it tucking you in. These are also 87% nylon and 13% elastane. So same as the bras, okay? Same material and everything. Again, true to size, these are very stretchy pieces, you guys. So there's some give in here. Let's talk the gusset crotch. You have a nice gusset crotch right in the middle here, okay? Nice triangle, all right? You got that stretch, you can go forward, you can go side lunge, you can do all that good stuff. All right, let's talk camel toe while we're talking about gusset crotch. The seam does run down the middle until it meets up with that gusset crotch back there. So for me, when I close my legs, if I'm standing up and I put it like them close together, I can see a slight camel toe, but when they're not like right up against each other, it's gone. 98% of the time, there is no camel toe for me, but ever so rarely, I'll see, like I'll catch myself if I'm like putting my legs together to get ready to jump rope, then I might see a little action going on down there. It's not enough to bother me at all, okay? It's just something if I'm like in front of a bunch of people, I just am a little bit mindful of that, but it's really like a non-issue for me. Both shorts and leggings are squat proof. I've squatted in every single one of these with the daylight on my bum. So I can say they're all opaque enough to be squat proof. <laughs> Cause let's be honest girl, okay? Other than the look of the leg and how it hugs your boot, hey? The squat proof is the only thing we all really care about. <laughs> Cause you gotta work on those gains, girl. I also wanna make note that I love the shorts. Like they're not like cropped up where it's riding up your Gucci and your booty ain't hanging out. I don't like that, but they're not overly long where they're considered biker shorts where you're just like, all right, like that's a long freaking short. This is like the freaking happy medium. And that's what I noticed when I first tried them on. I said that to my fiance, James. I said, I love that they are that perfect medium, okay? They're not up, riding up on you when you're trying to squat and they like roll, they don't roll up on you. They stay put. It's very rare for me to find shorts that I dig. So Abel did a great job on that for sure. As far as logo placement, you have the full Abel written out here on your left side. Okay, right on your like lower hip, all right? 
um, you do have the A, like that little cursive A logo on the back as well, right in the center. So you got it on the front and the back. All logos are white. Okay, white. <laughs> so the core shorts roll in at $28 each. Under 30, that's what's up. All right, let's talk leggings. I know that's why y'all are here for real. I wanna say, and this might be a bold thing to say right now, that the way that these are constructed, the durability, cause this is like, it's a breathable yet, but thicker, you can tell, like it's squat proof. It's not a thin legging. It's not like that thin, tiny, like rip a hole through it legging. It's not that at all. It's got that durability thickness to it that I like, that wicking. Mm. The quality, the material, and the high waist, like thick band, remind me a lot of Lululemon. So, like I said, this might be bold to say, but this could totally be, in my opinion, a Lululemon dupe. Uh, it's got all the same qualities, put it that way. Except like half the price. <laughs> and I don't know about you, girl, okay? In this day and age, I would much rather spend $38 on a legging than like 130, like for real. And the quality is literally like nearly identical, all right? I've tried Lululemon on in the dressing room. I remember how that fits. I remember how it looked. This is stupidly similar. <laughs> I want to note, I am 5'3", so I'm a little bit of a shorty. They are ever so slightly, about that much too long for me. That much. It's not enough for me to be pissed off. <laughs> it's like not noticeably long, but for me, most things are usually long. So guys, there is only one thing, one thing different between the core shorts and the core leggings, ready? Only one thing, and it is the gusset crotch. Whereas the core shorts had a small gusset crotch, the core leggings have a very large gusset crotch, straight through. This means you could do a full split and you're good. The length of this gusset crotch is literally like almost the whole legging, straight down the middle of your thighs. So that is insane. That is an insane stretch. That's the only difference between the two. What I like about this collection though, is the fact that it's very versatile. I feel like you can do yoga. It's got that stretch to it where you can do things like stretching, yoga, calisthenics. But for me, I've done hit in it. I've done other things as well because it has the kind of material for that. It has a nice happy medium between functionality and style. All right guys, that was it. That was the full detailed review on the Able Core Collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you have any questions at all, feel free to comment down below and I will help you out, girl, okay? Believe it. And again, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for new videos every single week on all things fitness because together we got this, baby. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.